We are back. What's up? We're back to doing old school Alip. Um, oh, new. Um, I tried to take notes on my Indonesian, man. I don't know. I don't know. So you're probably going to see this in the afternoon. So Salamat Siang. We're kind of to Salamat Malam, somewhere in there. And uh, yes, you told me that that's correct. That is some Api in the background. And new words. My Kuching is not here at the second because she is Sadang Tidur. She's like sleeping, napping, she napping. What a dude, it's like crazy attempting to, uh, whatever it is I'm attempting to do, that's kind of nuts. Um, hi. I'm wearing a ridiculous cat shirt, just came in the mail. Uh, Actually, not my favorite style, but it is kind of ridiculous. Hello. Oh, that doesn't look like it's talking. Hello. Uh, never mind. That doesn't work. No. It looks like my battery might die. Let's go. Let's go, let's go. Let's go then. Oh, <laughs> I didn't play it. 1.5 speed. Sorry, you're gonna see me look down repeatedly because I'm scared this battery's gonna die, but I can't, you know, what am I gonna do? Somebody seemed to do sweet picking. He's that was sweeping. edits or like are there two different sections of the song or something That's that's super fun. I like it a much, much. I like it a lot. That's another thing. Write that down. I like it. How do I be like? I like it. Let's do that. How I like it. Um. So let's talk about some stuff in there. Actually, some of the things that he did in there are they're like a cross between do two different things. One one is something that I don't do a lot of at all, which is hybrid picking, and then something else that I do a tremendous amount of uh i don't even know what to call it i'll just show you what it is it's making your sound bigger how do you make your sound bigger take the same notes 
but make it bigger. So let's see if I can do this before the mic pack runs out. Now the mic pack is in my pocket, so I won't know if it goes dead, and that could really be a bad, uh, a bad sign for us. Can I put this on? Will this work? No, it's gonna, okay, that kinda works. Okay, so hybrid picking is when you hold the pick, so now you have two, you know, appendages busy, the thumb and the index finger, but you still have three remaining. I never use the pinky, doesn't mean you can't. I just never do, never, never, not once. Um, but you could use these other two digits. So the uh, middle finger or the ring finger. And all you do is you play two notes, one with the pick, one with your middle. So it almost sounds like a finger style thing, except for you have a pick in your hand and you're using one extra digit. So I'm not, I don't do, I think hybrid picking is awesome. I know it mostly from like uh, six, 1960s, 70s rock and country where it's really awesome. Really, uh, just some guys that are killer at it. Just look up like hybrid picking country guitar and you'll, you'll probably find some amazing people doing that. Um, but let's talk about something that I have a lot more familiarity with, which I learned from... This might date me. I'm, I learned from Dave Matthews, Jack Johnson, and John Mayer. Those, and Stevie Ray Vaughan. Those four together really transformed the way I played with the pick when it came to playing guitar, uh, but making everything sound bigger. Let me give you uh, an example. I'll just make up uh, something. Well, what's something to do? So... Right? How the how can you make that bigger than it is? I'm already playing it loud. How you make it bigger is you hit other strings. But that wouldn't sound good. You couldn't go. That doesn't sound good. So what you actually have to do is keep your fretting hand flat, not curved. And then you rake across the strings. Like, I'm hitting five strings, like, all the time. Five strings. Five strings. Five strings. The only string I'm not hitting, really, is string number one. And that's not because I'm trying to avoid it. Just the angle of my pick attack, my hand is coming up before I hit the first string. But I'm not even scared of the first string. I can hit all six. I try to hit all six. I'm hitting six strings. And so it's a huge sound because you get the and you get the actual melodic notes. But so you gotta be able to have that sound, the chicka chicka chicka. So you keep your hand flat. And then you put single notes in. Of course, you can extend it to entire chords. And that is the Steve Ray Vaughan. I learned it from this, Pride and Joy. Where you, you hit the bass notes on the way down, you break the top strings on the way up, and you get chuck ka chuck ka chuck ka chuck ka And then you put a blues bass line in. But now you add the chuck a chuck in it, and it's awesome. What I love about, I don't actually have any idea what to call that. 
to me, it's just making a, a sound fuller. Instead of playing a single note, you add in all the surrounding strings percussively, but not separate. They're not separate from the attack. You don't hit the string and then hit something else. It's all in one motion with your picking hand. That, that is my favorite acoustic technique that I've ever learned to do. I, I love it. And if you, if you do it enough, you'll be able to do, um, like I should just do Ray Vaughan. You could also do like Dave Matthews crash into me. I can't play that much of it because, uh, they'll get you for copyright strike. The same type, same type of thing. Right? Or. Oh. Well, just funky weird things. Super fun. I love it. I will tell you, it took me a while to figure that out. I'm going to say from the time I tried to learn it to when I actually figured it out, I'm a slow learner sometimes. I'm going to say it took me three years. Sorry. But chances are you can do it faster than me because there's better guitar teachers out there. You've got YouTube videos. you got a lot of ways to study that I didn't have when I was first doing it. But yeah, that shit took me like three years. And I can still be better at it. But anyways. Ooh. Uh, Tarima Kasi, thanks for being here. Hope you come back because I have fun and I think you'll have fun. I can't promise that, but I think you will. And I am, I'm going to change this battery so I don't have to keep looking at it. Much love to y'all where you are. Peace, tranquility, happiness, all the cool words that like make people, you know, think good stuff. Be good out there. I'll try over here. You try over there. And um, even if we fail, it's worth trying. I'm out.